kind of just need to try and keep on doing damage. Don't die now. Come on. Oh, no. We're off him. Oh, don't kill me. Oh, good stuff. All his guns are gone. Oh, that was so close, man. We're at 91 HP. I was really worried there. All right, everybody. Hello and welcome back to another episode on Cross Out with me, Spacefish. And welcome back to our beautiful, beautiful garage. With us still very much busy, honestly, grinding some money together for some fancy equipment. You can see up here, I've made at least a tad bit of progress since the last episode, getting up to 130 bucks now. But we all know that the modifications can be quite, quite freaking expensive here, to be honest, and well, we're just still not quite there yet. So today will very much be just another episode of PvP and fun and, you know, blapping people and doing things, just, you know, going out there, killing some people and making that money for our future modifications. And, you know, then, then we go from there. So... It's pretty much the plan for today, nothing else really on the list. Before we get going though, if you're new around, if you do happen to enjoy this episode and you know all the fails when I probably get blapped, please make sure to go ahead and smash that subscribe button right down below, that would really mean the absolute world to me. Uh, we are slowly but surely going on to 1000 subscribers, but it's been quite the slow journey, so Every single person just truly helps out a ton. Thank you so much if you did that. And without further ado, let's move right on. Let's hit that back little icon and let's go and see and have some fun with a drill boy build. I do have to say, this honestly still is my best performing build. It feels like the, the wedge build has been doing well for us too. And, you know, it's very nice to spice things up, to do something different that way every now and again. But honestly speaking, the Drill Boy build has been absolutely insane. I have now, in between videos, had, like, games where, well, once more, you know, I took out the entire, well, half of the enemy team. Like, literally four people in a game. And, um, that, that's really not a rare occurrence with this thing. So, it's just literally the thing that does the best for us. Doesn't mean that the other builds aren't cool, but, you know, it's, it's just the best way to also... You know win games and that way get more resources and get more money which at the end of the day is really the crucial deal for us because the, the more money we get the better stuff we can make so you know that's that's all the plan right there now we do have to kind of be careful we're going to try to mostly just pick off people individually here not drive too much into everyone at once albeit that can sometimes be a bit difficult that said this guy is quite alone here Hello, sir. Hey, how are you doing? Oh, he's a drill boy as well. Oh, no. <laughs> well, <laughs> I mean, you're not going to get away from me here, mate. Like, you're absolutely flippin' lootly dead. Goodbye. Thank you very much for your service. That's one out of the way. Uh, with a little bit of help from a teammate, we are going to go and follow up with the enemies here. Make sure that our teammates are doing quite fine indeed. Um, like here, for example. Leave Sergei alone! Mate, come over here. Get the heck over here. Oh, God, um, why am I going right? That was not the plan. Hello! Good day, sir! Ah, uh, there go two of your guns, there goes the rest of you, and there you go instantly. Jesus Christ. I'm quite sure that I actually grabbed some of the ex explosives there with my drill. Let's go help the teammates save the base. I think they're probably already doing quite well at it. And, uh, well, that's apparently already the last people then. Jesus Christ. Um, what an insanely good game, I would say. Really, really happy with that indeed. I think we can totally, absolutely not complain about that. Team's been doing awesome, which is very, very great indeed. And, you know, nice and easy win for us. I always happily take that, you know, the extra bit of fuel when you do survive comes in handy. And on top of that, we move ahead with our daily goals, which are, you know, you can already spot that even today I've already done some of these, but we are moving ahead and we're getting those challenges ticked off, which is the most important point because those really give you a good bunch of extra stuff, which in turn means that we get even more money to spend at the cool things. And, you know, I mean, if you look at some of these prices, you can see just how far that is away. I don't think we're ever going to make these, to be honest, because they're just way too insanely priced. But, you know, 
some of the purple stuff with a lot of work is in range um especially you know that there is some things that don't quite cost as much and um you know some of those things i imagine are very much going to be an option now, the one thing that i do have to say i'm not too bothered about anymore is wheels to be honest ever ever since burner account really just let me know down below in the comments that you know that there was this uh thing where we could get ourselves uh, that free vehicle uh, with all the free parts, pretty much, you know, we've, we've got these wheels now, and I feel like they're more than sufficient. I'm quite happy with them. Uh, we've got the race wheels on top that, of course, we bought years back, so I think we can just save ourselves the money there for the time being. And really focus on weapons, because I feel like that's one of the main things. The other thing, maybe at some point, would be like a stealth module. I think that could end up being quite cool as well. Um, but you know, otherwise, it's, it's literally just weapons, maybe... A cabin at some point I just lost two teammates instantly I just lost three teammates instantly I'm not gonna drive straight into that um, the enemies are literally all in one spot and my team is like halfway dead so that is a bit of an issue kind of do need to get myself in there but I mean this is already a lost game Jesus Christ man uh, it's absolutely insane hello Reefer Oh, there goes one of your side guns, but you do need to take care of that main gun a bit. Oh, God, he's, like, pretty well armored. We really... Oh, there we go. Main gun's gone. Good stuff. Now, we really just kind of need to blap through that. Ooh, ooh. Hello. Ow! He just uh, self-destructed. I just heard that last second. No! Don't push me! No! Ah! Well. What? He didn't die for it? Are you serious? I I tried pushing the enemy into the poisonous lake, or in the, uh, whatever, a chemical lake, whatever it is, right? I missed, and then I, I got pushed into it, and I died. Which is not the way that we had planned that. But, uh, you know, then on top of that, the enemy didn't die for it, so I don't really like that one. Um, oh boy. Ah, uh, dude, run, run! He's self-destructing, run! <laughs> oh no, what happened there? He literally just got all of his guns blamped off instantly in one shot. That was honestly quite sad to see right there. Okay, well, you know, I guess we don't always get the great games. Sometimes uh, we just get blamped. So let's try and not have that happen to us again. It's the same map this time around. So um, we, I guess we're all pinging. Um, let's try and not go in there again, shall we? We, we can probably, you know, try and avoid that this time around. Um, saying that, I think we all know that now I'm instantly going to go in there just because, you know, I absolutely jinxed the heck out of that. But we'll see. We'll find out just how well that one's going to go. We're following Edward around here and there's a little Hannah right there. Well, I mean, Hannah's going a different way. Oh, there's someone else though. Ethan! Okay, let's, let's blap the bots, I guess. Just gonna help the teamy. Ooh, sorry, teammate out. I do not want to drive that way, to be honest. It's like straight into all the enemies. And on top of that, he's really not helping us, just shooting them all. But Mr. Deadpool here is absolutely overexposing himself. Totally not aware that there's two of us here. So um, we can definitely take care of him, I would say. Absolutely beautiful. One actual uh, person out of the way on top of that. So. Great stuff here with me and Edward, and, uh, well, hopefully we can move on to take out a few more of these guys. I think he's still got, like, explosive lances on the top or something, so fingers crossed on that part. Uh, I do have to take out some guns here for a quick second, or, well, maybe they're just the entire dude. That's one out of the way, and then we've got Speedo with a lot of guns blazing my way. Come on, just destroy something here. Yes, that's a gun off him. But we really kind of don't want to go at him from the front. I don't really have a choice, so I kind of just need to try and keep on doing damage. Don't die now. Come on. Oh, no, we're off him. Oh, don't kill me. Oh, good stuff. All his guns are gone. Oh, that was so close, man. We're at 91 HP. I was really worried there, especially when I lost my track on him with the drills for a quick second. I thought that was it. But my team came in clutch just the right second there. Shooting the last gun off of him at 91 HP. Like, that could have really not been any closer, to be honest.
That that was really, really, really freaking close. I uh, did get another level there, which, you know, it is something, I guess. I'm not too sure I usually care too much about that. But we're moving on right into the next one, yo. Going to keep grinding away, making that money, and uh, hopefully fulfilling some more objectives. I think one more win, then we should have another one down. And uh, then let's see what we get next for an objective. Maybe we will have to end up doing PvE again at some point. That said, you know, I think... The only way we are going to be doing PvE today is if there's a mission that is actually quite short in terms of time taken. You know, like a uh, shoot all the towers mission. That, I think, is acceptable. If we have anything else, like, you know, escort something, or even the quite cool, like, tower defense mission that we had a while ago, I don't think we are going to be doing that, to be quite honest with you. Now, looking around here, I mean, these guys are really splitting themselves. So, I think we're going to assist here first things first hello mr yanis we are gonna pay this guy a quick visit oh my god i just knocked him over ah. <laughs> well i think he's a bit disabled now um jesus christ that that was uh quite mean i didn't mean to do that but you know i'll take it and that's one out of the way team's doing quite well overall which is good good news indeed and there's a bunch of enemies right there on one poor poor teammate so Let's go and help this guy out. Take one out right away. Get off my freaking teammate. Everyone's coming in to help. Absolutely beautiful. And uh, I I'm really not latching on here for the drill. But I think, you know, at this point, it doesn't really matter. That dude is uh, more than dead, I would argue. And now there's not really that many remaining. Mr. TTV Phoenix Hydra right here. Which I think I actually deleted in a previous off-camera game today. Is headed on to the cab. So we can definitely not allow that to happen. We will most certainly make sure to make that lad, uh, well, to pay that lad a quick visit. Really wondering if he's actually on Twitch. If so, go and pay him a quick visit and say hi from me, I guess. <laughs> and tell him what he said down below. Uh, tell me, rather, what he said down below in the comments. I'd love to hear. That is him out of the way as well, though. New cat for you. And now we're all looking for an Emily. God. Um... Flippin' Emily. I think Emily is a, is a bit of a meme in Germany in terms of a name. I don't think it's an international meme, but, um... Emily just killed the friend! Emily killed Frank! Emily, why are you so cruel? That is not nice. Oh, well, there goes Emily. Absolutely drilled to bits. I do have to say I'm really enjoying this drill boy build. Like nothing comes even close to it. I, I feel it's just awesome. That said, that's another daily challenge out of the way, which is beautiful and um, gets us also one st uh, stage further on these. Now we do have to win in one raid and I'm really debating if we do want to do it at all, to be honest. I'm, I'm never really too, too, <laughs> too happy to see this stuff. Uh, let us see. So, direct attack will cause... So, we'll have to secretly capture the tower and steal the fuel. I think this is the one that is fast. So, I think we're going to take that one, right? We're going to hope that this is actually a fast one. And we're just going to go for it. We at least now have an engine which should allow us to move a little faster. And then we'll try and have that one through rather quickly. That way, you know... We at least make progress, which I think is the main thing at the end of the day. You know, we all want to check out some new fancy toys, especially weapons, of course, because who doesn't love a new set of weapons? And um, it's the fastest way, unfortunately. At the end of the day, you know, if if we look at this, this is like... It's going to get us like 35 extra scrap metal instantly. And we're quite close to actually being able to sell off a stack of copper, so we do get that on top. So, you know, kind of really just do want to get that out of the way. That said, you know, we technically, I guess, don't even have to do these. I have to say, like, the crafting part I have done in absolute ages. Um, but, yeah, I mean, win one raid. Win two battles in missions or raids using a machine gun, rapid fire machine gun, minigun, or combat laser. Good thing I'm not using those anymore in any vehicles, to be honest. But it is what it is, you know. There's stuff we can do quite easily, so I think we'll just get it out of the way. And hopefully it is actually... Uh, the stuff now where, you know, capturing the oil tower. I think that was one of the shorter ones. I really hope it is, because anything long, you know. At some point, you just get to the point, I think, where you don't want to play uh, any PvE raids at all anymore. So, we're you know, not trying to do that. That said, um, 
Got it is able to generate us, should be nice and quick. Nice and split from the team there, should also help us doing these things rather quickly. First one being right here. Oh, hello there. Oh. Um. Ow. Gonna get rid of some damage here first. Right, just getting the guns off basically. There we go. Okay, now I can just disable that. Uh, well, I think I have to actually stand in the face of it to disable it. Oh, then no, we're good to go. I mean, that guy just doesn't even have any guns anymore, so, you know. He's pretty much useless, which is beautiful. Generator disabled. Now we need to protect the thing. And I really hope it's just three minutes of protecting it. Oh, no. Protecting the truck. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Is this really now another escort mission? This really doesn't have to happen. Come on, guys. Uh, the one thing... Oopsies. Um, the one thing that I'm a bit worried about is my driving. <laughs> the other thing that I'm a bit worried about is uh, my... Uh, engine and my radiator has been a bit exposed to the back there. I'm kind of hoping I'm not going to lose them because... Using this thing without a radiator isn't really too nice in terms of how long you can really still fire at the end of the day. Okay, there goes your gun. I don't care about you anymore. Um, no. There goes your gun. I don't care about you anymore either. Is, is there any teammates still left? Hello? How the heck am I the only one defending against all these dudes? What was that? Oh, that is that, isn't it? Go away with your freaking gun. Thank you. Right, now these guns to go... Oh my god, there's even more. All these gun trailers, like, Jesus Christ, there's so many of them. Okay, there we go. Hi, team. <laughs> Good to see you guys. <laughs> Just disabled them all on my own, but hey, it's fine. <laughs> okay, another one out of the way. I'm literally just getting rid of the guns and I'm not caring much about them anymore, unless, I guess, I don't have anything else to shoot at. Ooh, hello there. Guess now I have something to shoot at. I think I already shot all of the guns off him. Pretty much, and there he goes. Did go for a little boop of a ram, but <laughs> not like that did much. Okay. Minute 38 remaining. Good thing is that this is quite easily defendable. They can really only come from one direction here. Let's, let's hope that I didn't jinx it, but you know. Overall, I would argue that that's quite true, and... Really holding them off quite nice and easy. Not much work or anything at all. It, it usually really isn't much work with the raids, you know? It's more of a... It's more of a time thing, usually. It's all always quite easily doable, or at least 99% of the time. But generally speaking then, it does become a bit of a time thing sometimes. I do really wonder, by the way, how they made these trailers. Like, do they technically have cabins on the trailers as well? Hi, Gamer Walter. People are coming from there, but hey. Ow. Go away with your freaking gun. Thank you. People actually doing damage to me. I don't like it. <laughs> it's fine. We've still got 800 HP. I mean, we're, we're literally about done defending, and I'm really not mu very stressed about any... Oh, my God. What is that? Um... Maybe, maybe it's time to be stressed, but what is that monstrosity right there? That is quite mad. Okay. Oh, oopsie. Sorry, I forgot about you. Apologies. Boop, boop. Hey, I, I'm happy to be your cover. <laughs> no worries at all. Well, you know, um... Oh, there comes another wave. Go, truck, go. Ow! Oh, help! I'm being bullied by the truck. What in the world, man? What in the freaking world? That guy was about to get bullied as well. But, you know, the truck decided against it. Apparently, easier to just annoy me. Hi. Go away with your guns. Thank you very much. Okay, bye. I'm going to escort the truck now. Oh, he actually still has some. What? Bye. Wow, that truck's far away already. Let's catch up, shall we? I think there was, yeah. Well, that's gone. Okay, come on, let's get out of here. Let's let's get this PvE mission over with already so we can uh, have some more fun doing some PvP after this. I don't know. You know, it's still not that long of a mission, which is good, but I still feel it's 
a little monotone compared to, you know, what you usually get in the PvP environments. I, I like that a lot more. Now, you know, I think the truck... No, I guess the truck is moving as fast as it can. I don't know. I was going to say I think I could it could move faster if the fourth lad from the team would also be here, but maybe that's not the case. I don't even know. That said, bye to you. Oh, where's the leader at? Oh, leader's right there. Probably want to align what I have left of armor to him. Did I just do like... Oh my god, look at the damage I'm racking up at range on the dude. Well, that isn't lit until like uh, something gets in the way, but hey. Like 700 damage from that range. Nice. Quite, quite nice indeed. And look at this. Now we're blapping these guys right there. Hi. Bye, guns. Bye to that gun. Oh, sorry, teammate. Didn't want to shoot you there. Now we kill all these dudes. Oh, yeah, there's actually like a cab attached to that, right? I think so. And, uh, oh, wait, that's an enemy. I thought that was like a teammate uh, hugging me right there. Cute. Cool. There we go. That's all that out of the way. As usual, honestly. I mean, ah, these things are just not eventful enough for me. But, you know, we got a daily challenge out of the way, so that's great. We're not going to do the second raid stage, so I think at this point we've all suffered through enough of that. We'll go and bring out the wedgie boy for a last proper PvP game of the day instead. I think I think that's a better choice, to be honest. You know, <laughs> at some point. Uh, you got to stop doing PvE and cross out and you got to start enjoying life, man, man. <laughs> well, I would argue that this is the way, way better approach. So we're going for that and hopefully it should be nice. Let's see just how it goes. Uh, fingers crossed that we don't get blapped into macro seconds, so, um, you know, we'll see, we'll see. Keep keep your fingers crossed for me, all right, and we'll see how just how it goes. Going ahead, though, gotta, gotta go hit that button for a quick second, you know, show off our fancy, like, uh, gems at the back there. Oh, boy, that's a lot of people. They're all in the middle of the day. Oh, my God. Okay, there's a few chilling at the back, so I think that'll be the approach to go for. Oh god, oh Jesus Christ, I'm right smack bang in the middle, this is not good. Um, Hi Dario! Dario, wait please mate, mate. Leave my friend alone, alright? We don't like drill boys around here, so please... Oh! Well, I heard that. Did they change something about the speed at which people can self-destruct? Because I literally just heard that absolutely the last second right there. Oh my god, I just absolutely disabled that guy with no intent whatsoever. Like, everything was just gone on him instantly. I am so sorry. Well, we're gonna go die now, I feel like, because we don't really have much left. That is, until we, unless we take the guns off of absolutely everyone here. Like that, you know. Oh no, don't do it, don't do it, don't do it! Oh, that was fun. <laughs> I mean, to be honest, we did quite a lot for the team there. Um, technically kill that last guy. We did kill a guy prior to that. That was also, you know, well, self-destructing in our face, but we saved a teammate from the drill boy, and uh, on top of that, we also took the guns off of one dude entirely. So, can't really say that we didn't do anything there, but I do feel that that war warrants one more game. So, you know, let's go for it, let's check it out, and then we can call it after that one, but I think we should go and get one more going. So, um, let's see how this one goes. Really, really interested. Hopefully, somewhat decently. Um, yeah, cool, thank you. Uh, I kind of want to go that way, but, you know, fine, you do you. We are going to go to see, maybe, we kind of have to see... Technically, the max amount of people in a cap is always three, so... I mean, looking at this, I guess we will also only get three, so we'll probably have to stay around here for a quick second. I'm not sure... Oh, hello, George. Why can you not just drive up on my wedge, eh? Mate. Oh, wow. He is gone. He is absolutely just gone. And I'm the only person capping. Not anymore. Okay, Alexis is out here. 
We're just going to leave it to Alexis, I think. It'd actually help out the team. I feel like just chilling there is a bit of a waste. Especially now that we got rid of the first person going that way. And then we will uh, say hello to Mr. Elise or Mrs. Elise or anyone. And then we say hello to Isabella. And we should probably use our boost sometimes too, just saying. Uh, but hey, can we like actually shoot off the guns? Thank you. Oh my god, that was mayhem. What just happened there? No, no, go away. I don't want to be drilled to bits. Oh, there's a generator exposed to the back there. Ah, oh, too late. Um, it's a bit of an issue what, what I've got myself into here because I can't really shoot the other guy's guns off. Oh, there's a Jenny. Come on, give me your Jenny. Well, there goes one of your guns. I need to shoot off his wheels, I think, but like the gun's got to take priority. Ah, oh, no, there's more people. Re. There was no teammates left. I had his guns gone and I would have tackled like the wheels and then the generator next. But there was just not enough teammates there. And for some reason I'd also lost like two out of my three guns, which really wasn't great. So, um, well, not all too successful off and end to this episode. But I think still quite fine. We did gather a good bunch of scrap metal. So that should equate to a good bunch of money for us. And of course, you know, as usual, I will keep grinding in between episodes. And then let's see in the next episode just how far that gets us. And hopefully we will slowly but surely start getting into the realms of us being able to think about some of these cooler weapons. I think, you know, 200, maybe 300 is when it starts. I hope it's more like 200. Uh, but one way or another, it's a good bit to go. So, you know, with the money that we made today and the money that I should be able to make in between this and the next episode, I think we may get ourselves to around the 200 bucks mark. And then let's see just what cool stuff that can get us or if we need to keep going a bit further but one way or another you know i think we had a good bunch of fun today good bunch of fun battles i hope you all very much enjoyed it of course if you did please make sure to go ahead and smash that like button right down below for the youtube algorithm and if you're new around here and haven't done so just yet also please consider subscribing right down below as well as hitting that bell icon in order to stay up to date on all the future upcoming episodes but with all that out of the way then, as usual everybody, thank you so much for watching and I hope I will catch you in the next episode very, very soon. Ciao.